Yeah. We rocking? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> we are rocking. What's up with y'all, man? It's your boy McFly, the hardest working man in shoe tainment today. Coming at you again and with another gas or pass live, man. I just realized that I hadn't even hadn't put up a video since like last week. I was like, oh man, I got to get on it. You know, I missed Gas or Pass last week, but I'm currently leaving um, Dick Sporting Goods. You dig? I had to sign up for them uh, Cloud Yeezys that's dropping. I didn't really want them um, Centrin joints or whatever they're trying to call them. I wasn't really feeling them, man, so I just went ahead and uh, went and got that done. What's up with y'all? What's up? I see y'all down that comment, but I'm whipping, so I can't really pay attention to the chat I would normally pay attention to the chat, but if I can catch it while you're popping up, you know, it would be good. Make sure you hit that like button for your boy, man, because I'm out here risking it all. <laughs> I'm out here risking it all to talk to y'all, man, but I figured... I'm down here on the south side of Charlotte, man, and I got to head back to the northwest side where I reside. So that's a good, that's a good, uh, that's a good 30, 35 minute haul. That's that's what people don't understand about Charlotte, bro. It takes you a clean hour to get across town. It it don't make no sense. And you still be in the same city. It's ridiculous, man. It makes absolutely no sense. But um, apparently, Dick Sporting Goods, is um get Yeezys, bro. You see, I got my lights dimmed and all that. I'm about to tell y'all some ghost stories and all that. Once upon a time, <laughs> now, nah, but um, Dix is getting Yeezys, so I didn't know um I didn't know that was a thing. I had no idea. I knew Dix got J's and um certain Adidas and stuff, Ultra Boost and all that, but I didn't know that um they got Yeezys, man. So if you want those Cloud Yeezys. You in the Charlotte area, Mecklenburg County, Matthews, Pineville, Mint Hill, Rock Hill, Fort Mill, any of that stuff that's in decent driving range, Huntersville, Canadian, Davidson, <laughs> whole run down, Mooresville, if you feel like fighting the traffic. Uh, you might want to check in with your with your nearest Dick Sporting Goods, man, and see what they're doing. Uh, raffle look, look pretty legit, so we'll see about that and uh, how that goes. Hopefully I get the dub, man. I want them to keep. I ain't trying to flip them. But I know if Dix is getting them, then then they're gonna be everywhere. Like the streets is gonna be flooded with these um with these clouds. So you already know. Hopefully I can get a pair of day one for the retail. Cause that's what I like. For the retail. Or the under the retail. But yeah, basically we got two uh two main shoes, man. Popping off this week, we got those uh, Royal Blue Jordan 12s. Uh, it's, a little, it's a little buzz, man. Come on, bro. Why? Why? How, how come people get in the fast lane to drive 12 miles an hour, bro? Yo, if cars was built with, like, rockets and, and machine guns, like, in real life, twisted metal, bro, that car, that truck right there, kaboom, they would have got it out of there. <laughs> Sent that, sent that homing missile right after them. Knock them out the park, bro. Straight up. But um, those Royal 12s are dropping. Um, they uh, they looking pretty good. I can't front. Those uh, Cloud Yeezys are dropping. Um, I think those Air Maxes might have dropped today. They got a couple different Air Maxes dropping with the stripes going around. But I hadn't had time to check my... Um, Sneakers app or whatnot, and as you can see, I ain't at the crib, so I ain't, you know, I ain't, I ain't trying to multitask, multitask, but if they didn't drop already, then they are definitely dropping this week. I like that black and, uh, that black and baby bluish looking pair. I dig those, but I'm gonna pass on them. That ain't really a big deal. But those Royal 12s, man, and the Cloud Yeezy, that's probably gonna be the battle for uh this weekend or whatnot who's who's gonna do the best who's gonna sell the best who who's gonna reign supreme and all that in that battle and i personally think that probably i think they both gonna sit in real life i see them both selling out at some point but i think they're both gonna sit bro both of them um those 12s are cool but i'm not about to day one cop those i like the way they look 
I like how the blue looks on them. I don't really like that that maybe suede. I don't I don't want no I don't want no suede on my twelves, bro. I don't want no suede. Oh whoa, what's going on? Yep. Here comes the traffic. <laughs> Here comes the traffic. Yeah, I don't want no uh I don't I don't like suede on my twelves, man. I'm not I'm not that guy. But if that if that was a flu game, just like a flu game with the same materials on the side paneling with that, but blue, I probably would have day one copped it. But that maybe suede, not suede, that gym red, we don't know if it's suede or not suede, or if suede got a haircut or all that, bro. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. I have no idea. But I'm gonna let them things ride. If I can get them, uh, if I can get them for cheap, if I can get them for cheap, then I'll go ahead and cop. Um, like I said, man, I see y'all down there commenting, and when I get to the crib, I'll, uh, I'll run the chat up and look at it so I can see what y'all talking about. I can't risk my life right now. You ever been on these Charlotte highways? Yeah. Woo! It's another game right here. The lane's too small and the whip's too big, and the people ain't got no sense. But Blue 12s, they all right, bro. They not terrible. If I can get them for cheap, I'll gladly get them for cheap, but I'm not about to day one retail them. These um, Cloud Yeezys, I'm definitely going to try to get them joints. I'm not going to pay the ups for them. If I can't get them for retail, then I just won't have them. Like, it ain't really a huge deal to me. I just want to try to get them so I can get me a day one uh, retail joint. Damn. J23 talking about something, and I can't read this shit. Fuck. Oh, well. J23 just sent out a notification about something. I think it's that update required, though. But, uh, yeah, the Yeezys, I need them. Hopefully, I get a pair of day ones. And when they mass produce like that, a lot of the small sizes sit, but them big sizes be gone in a hurry, hurry. So, uh, yeah, you know, us big footers, we got to get in and, and do our thing off real because you never really know what's going to happen with that. Just like with them Yebras, them uh, McChickens, them 350s, them things sat like crazy. And the small sizes, but them big sizes, gone, gone. I think Yeezy Mafia only had one of them. So it's like, bro, you just, you got to risk it all for them to try to get it. So you already know I'm going to try my best to land my pair, uh, my pair, like I'm from St. Louis or something, my pair, down there. <laughs> Get that done, man. Get that out the way. Get that review out this weekend or whatnot. Got some other stuff coming up this week, man, that I think y'all really gonna like. Uh, collection video coming up. Got a couple uh, sneaker battles coming up. Got some other stuff coming up. You know, just keep your eyes out for it. But um, what y'all what y'all thinking about, man? What y'all leaning towards or interested in or any of that? If you catch it on the playback or whatever. You know, just drop a comment, man. Let your boy know what you got your eyes on. Um, I personally think, like, I'm going to go through it again. I personally think the cloud, uh, uh, clouds is going, I don't know. I think they may hang around because it's some it's big numbers on them. But the big size is definitely going to be gone. Those 12s, I see them 12 sitting. Uh, but eventually they're going to sell out. I don't see them going to outlets or nothing like that, but I do see them selling out maybe in a month or two, something like that, or maybe like the first sale, you know, they'll probably uh, they'll probably get gone in that regard. But it's, it's been so long since um, Jordan Brand really released a dope 12. So it may, it may, uh, it, it, it may actually go because people ain't really seen no no hot twelves in a while, so I don't know. We'll see. Everything beeping at me, bro. What's going on? What it is? What you want? Why you beeping? Bow. You're not beeping no more. <laughs> End of the beeps, man. But that's uh for this week. That's all that I was really concerned with was the twelves and the Yeezys. Um, last week was crazy, man. I was so mad that I didn't try for nothing last week, man. Them Pharrells, all them Pharrells dropped. I definitely wanted them uh them tan joints, them uh tan um uh, uh them tan NMDs. Lord I wanted them them tan HUs, but them things was butter. But I thought they was gonna sit just like that solar pack from last year. But now them things
guys got gone in the big sizes pretty fast. Uh, they had a pair of those uh, Volt, those Volt BYWs drop. Those joints were pretty clean. Came front on that. I'm gonna definitely uh, try to backtrack on those. Get a pair of them when they go on silly willy. Cause I'm not paying that full price and wise it on them things. You did. I'm not about that life. Look, when it comes to stuff that I know it's gonna sit. But uh, those uh, Hirachi, those Hirachi uh, BBs, the Hirachi Adapts drop, those things were dope, but I can't pay the ups. That uh, Them prices is crazy. And I'm not a huge fan of them Adapt shoes, man. Like, they're not, they not that great. People people be hyping them Adapts, man, and they not they not that. Like, them Adapts ain't that dope like that. Like, people be trying to act like, them adapts is dope and they cool but they not they not they not all that they not all that they not worth 300 or 350 or whatever they outrageous price that they're charging for them things they definitely ain't worth that but it was some heat man it was some heat to drop man i just didn't have time to uh to go up and really get nothing out to really talk about it and i was like man Missed my boat on that one. Those um, Nick 3s drop. I ain't been to the mall, but I'm pretty sure them Nick 3s is, is sitting until the end of time. Um, of course, the New York fans going to buy them. You already know they going to come. But for all us regular people that ain't New York fans, now, nah, bruh, y'all can keep them. I don't care how good the quality is. I don't care nothing about them. Nicks, no thank you. <laughs> No thank you at all. I don't need no Nick associations. None of that. I don't even think I know too many people named Nick. I think I know one person named Nick. That's it. No Nicks, bro. No Nicks. At all. But I rock with threes a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit. Not a whole lot, but a little bit. So, but yeah. Epic week, man. My money wasn't right. Went to that uh, Class Champions WWE pay-per-view. That thing was crazy. We had uh, floor seats to that joint. We was uh, behind the announce table. We was like, we was seven seven rows back. Seven rows back from the announce table, man. We got them tickets for uh, $153. $153 a piece we got them tickets for. So... I was like, cool, bet, we going. Because the whole time we was looking at the tickets, bro, them tickets was like $500, $600 for a floor seat. And I was like, bro, I'm not about to pay that for no floor seat. Then they dropped down to like 303 And I was like, man, I might pay the 303 That's the pay-per-view that then came to Charlotte. You already know. I'm probably about to go ahead and cash out on that. But held out. And today, Saturday, the show was Sunday. So Saturday the uh, seats for that one little section. It was like a strip of like four seats. They was on sale for 153 Had to get them. Jumped on them. Got them seats. Got to watch the show. Um, I don't know how many people that are subscribed to my channel are really into uh, wrestling and WWE and all that, but I know it's a lot of people that, that rock with it. I felt like the show wasn't really that great, but it was cool. They had some decent matches, some interesting matches or whatnot. Um, that was my first pay-per-view and getting to see it live, man, was really a thing of beauty. They orchestrated it pretty nice, but the matches were really quick. And, you know, I could probably do a whole, <clears throat> I could probably do like a whole separate live just on the WWE stuff alone. Like, yo, if you catch this, uh, let me know if you want to want me to do a uh want me to do a playback of the uh, of the WWE joint. And I gave you my rundown, my opinions and all that on that joint for anybody that's uh for anybody that's interested in my opinion. I know shoes up, sleeves down, rah rah, uh goat skinny, a couple of other cats. Uh they rock with the they rock with the WWE thing. So it is what it is. And we're almost to the crib, so I can get in here and uh, 
hop in this chat here in a second, man. Y'all just be patient and uh, bear with your boy right quick, you know? No big deal, nothing major. Appreciate y'all hanging in there and all that. Damn, I'm speeding. Let me slow down a little bit. Snitching on myself. <laughs> <laughs> Snitching on myself and everything. Um, I think I might have missed something, bro. I know it's probably some other shoes um, dropping this week, man. You can uh, comment in the chat if you know something else that's dropping outside of them 12s and them um, Yeezys. I can pick that up. Right, quick, when I uh, get back, get back in the house, right, quick, you know, all that shit. I think, uh, hell, SmackDown probably on right now, but I ain't even about to try to watch it, bro. Good on that. <laughs> Good on that for sure. Man, I'm fifty. I'm fifty fifty on these twelves, man. Them royal blue twelves. I'm legit fifty fifty on those. I don't really know what I want to do, man. I keep saying that I'm gonna let it ride, man, and probably try to pick up on them on the back end. But if I get out here on Saturday on the hunt, man, and I see them things and they looking right, or the pairs in my size is, is looking right, man, I might, man, I don't know. Uh, undecided. <laughs> We're gonna put that in the undecided category. Uh, I don't know if I would necessarily call them gas though, but they they probably like just something in between gas and pass, like medium medium flame, low flame. Like they fire, but they not the blue flame. Is, is that legal? Can can you get away with that? You probably could. I ain't too sure. It is. All right, man. We back at the crib now, man. If y'all wouldn't mind I'm holding on for a brief intermission while I get my life right, I'll be right back. Oh, damn. Didn't turn my speakers off. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, Jesus. Sound like a scary movie out here, like something about to get attacked out this joint. Something about to come out the woodwork. An attack. Like, man, they got me. Boom. Laptop still running. Oh, nope. Turn that volume down right now. Hey, yo, uh, hey, Dom, I don't know if you're going to run that live back or not, but there you is, bro. They had you on run. You can get that. Get that time, G. Because that's how we do things. Shout out to Dom, by the way. Ugly shoes only. Cool cat. Bam. Close that out. Pull that back up. Bam. Man, they show uh they show clips for the lives, bro. I mean they do ads on the live. Let there be light. <laughs> it is. We got light now. Alright, man, let's see what we got popping. Oh man, we got a comment. Man, I was in the building. Oh man, what's up with Matt and I, bro? Shout out to them, man. If y'all not uh if y'all don't watch uh, Matt and I, man, y'all definitely need to check them out. Mr. Smith, Super Swole was in the building. Uh, Cuzzo Sharika. 
How you whipping and lie, hey man. <laughs> we we talented out here, you know what I'm saying? Don't tell nobody. Shout out to Sharika. Three one three Retro Queen was in the building. Are you on live and driving? Yeah. <laughs> gang gang. <laughs> That's what we do, man. I do not have road rage. Those Jeezys ain't sitting, bro. Nah, they might not. I think they're going to sit, though. Well, the big sizes will be gone for sure. Yeah, that blue needed to be leather. Yeah, 313, understand. Chaotic, keep pushing. Shout out to Chaotic, man. Straight up. Had a long conversation with that man yesterday. Cloud Yeezy's gone. 12's going to sell out online, but stores going to have them. About a month, like you said. Facts, I'm not rocking with those that died big, bro. That ticket too rich for my blood, man. Chaotic, the richest man in the world. <laughs> Talking about the ticket too rich. Too rich for his blood, man. Get out of here. Oh, hey, Chaotic, man. I don't know if you still in here, bro. He probably gone, though. Damn. How you turn the camera around? Boom! That joint showed up today, bro. About to put it up on the IG on the Funko channel, man. About to go to ah. Ah, 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 Hannibal on deck, cuz. So happy about that. Wait, did I just see Aquila? Hey, what's up, sis? Okay, I see you down there. You off work, chilling? About to go to sleep over there? Hey, what up, GQ? I see you down there, too, bro. Ain't nothing, man. Was just risking my life on the live just now. <laughs> Risking my life on a lie while I was driving. Had some uh, time on my hands coming from the other side of town. So you already know. Had to do that. Okay, I'm good, man. I'm tired, though. It's my first time really being in the crib all day, man. Um, came home for a brief second, then had to head all the way down to um, South Park. It was crazy. Where you find that Hannibal at? Um, I pre-ordered that joint from, um, Pop in the Box, uh, GQ. Pop in the Box had them on, um, they had them on restock. So I went ahead and, uh, well, they had a pre-order restock or something. They was up there, so I just went ahead and grabbed for the early. I've been waiting on it to show up for weeks, man. Like, I pre-ordered that thing a while ago, and it finally showed up today. Oh, I didn't know the um, 34s was dropping so soon. All right, man, let's get into it. For real, for real. Right now. Oh, <coughs> pull my chair up. <laughs> pull my chair on this thing. Turn it around. Boom! Y'all see what we're doing, man? Y'all see what we're doing? Sorry, bro. So happy to be off tomorrow. Yeah, the way you be working, man, you need, like, whole weeks off. Like, for real. Work 15 hours, 14 hours, and 13 hours, bro. Slavery is real, G. You can't do nothing but sleep. I'm about to go, uh, I'm about to go holler at the people in VA and tell them to cut you some breaks or something. Like, for real. This ain't, that ain't fit for nobody. Yo, IBA, what up, bro? I see you down there, man. We just chilling. Going over these releases or whatnot, man. Yeah, bro, I ain't had to. I should have hit you up, man, but your video, bro. That thing was clean, cuz. That thing was clean, clean. Chaotic broke out them burners on you, though. <laughs> the boy Chaotic was hawking you, dog. Don't say you wasn't running. I know you. I know. I know. I know you was running. You know what I mean? You, yeah, you were getting it. But wait, man, we definitely need more of that, bro, especially for the culture, man, straight up. Now, I wasn't even fronting when I was saying that I was going to um, hit that joint off the Nike. I need to um, get that petition rolling for everybody to sign or whatnot or put their name in the hat or something and send that on up to up to Nike corporate so they know how we feeling out here, man. We sick of this. But booyah. We got these Mushroom 4s, man, and y'all know that I'm not the biggest 
fan of fours, but sitting here looking at this, this this colorway and this color blocking ain't terrible. Like I know E Money will probably be shocked that I said a Jordan Four wasn't terrible, but these these mushrooms ain't ain't that bad. Like I would I would probably actually wear that joint. Like straight up, no no BS, man. Those those are pretty cool. I get that a gas for sure. Wait, is that leather or is that some other? Is that like Bichetta tan or something? Oh, is that is that is that is that even a men's shoe? Like, ah, oh, damn. See, I knew something was up. <laughs> I knew it, man. I knew something was up, man. That's a dang on women's shoe, man. Women's get all the heat. And uh, these thirty fours, man. I didn't know that they were that they were dropping. What? That's th that's next week. They dropping next week. But um. Those ain't bad. Um, not them black and white ones, but these these risky joints right here for one seventy five. I might cop a pair. I might actually um attempt to try those try those out for sure. Wait, this say them twelves come out on the twenty eighth. They don't drop this week. This what's today the seventeenth. So the Yeezys dropping by themselves. They dropping. They not dropping with those. The four is dropping first. The thirty fours is coming, and then the twelves drop next week. Oh, so I'm a week ahead. Oh well, we done done it now. <laughs> we done done it now. Ain't no backtracking. These uh yellow things right here, trash. Don't hot garbage, bro. Don't even waste my time on that. Um, how, how y'all feel about that price hike that's coming out for 2020 on these Jordan ones? You can kiss that. You can kiss that 160 goodbye. You see that 160 right there? Gone. It's out of there in 2020, man. How y'all feel about that? I'm a little upset about it. I don't mind if the quality go up with the price of the shoe, but if you you going to drop a crap shoe and uh, your quality ain't right, I'm going to be upset. What in the world is this trash? Oh, man, see, that's what happens when you scroll too far. You get down here in October, and I shouldn't even be down here, but I'm here now. So, But that right there, that, that's got to be grade school. I know that ain't a men's shoe. Size run, N.A., yeah. That's going to be for kids, bro. That is, <laughs> that, that, right, <laughs> that right there, kids. Got to be for kids. These red nines. Nah, I don't know about that. They kind of clean, but I ain't pressed on those. I don't even wear my um, I don't even wear my OG nines like that. They make my pinky toe hurt. And I want to get them uh, UNC nines for the Lowski Wolski just because, but I ain't about to buy and it's gonna make my pinky toe hurt. I ain't whoo, them Seattle's boy, them Travis's boy, definitely need them Travis's. Definitely need them Seattle tens. Ain't no way I'm buying the chicken greases. I'm not touching them. Not touching them chicken greases. They can keep all of that. Like, I mean, that would have been a dope shoe regular, man. Take, take the baby oil. Take the baby oil off the shoe. You can leave that cell midsole or whatever. You can leave that. But just, you know, paint it. Paint the, the bottom, the actual sole. Paint that a color. Either paint it orange or painted black or whatever, just don't leave it like that, looking like a damn eraser. Like, don't nobody want to see that, man. If anybody buy this shoe to keep it, you are a certified hype beast, or you eat a lot of chicken, and you drop grease everywhere, so your shoes end up looking like that anyway. That look like the shoe that your mama put you in before you go to church on Sunday, when they you put your good clothes back in the day when people used to dress up for church, <laughs> and you put your good clothes on, and your mama put that Vaseline and cocoa butter and all that all over your face, and you walk outside looking like a slave. That's what them is. Them shoes. The baby oil slavery ones. Seattle's definitely going down. Travis Scott's definitely going down. I might even have my bot by then. Take all the worries away. Yeah, them Seattle 10s is definitely fire. What is this trash. What come, bud? But listen. <laughs> a patent leather seven. 
a patent leather seven G. A patent leather seven. A, pa <laughs> a patent leather seven, man, yo. That's horrible, bro. Ain't no way. I ain't, I ain't even gonna scroll down no more. We gonna hop off the Jays. Y'all already know them Seattle's, them Travises. Definitely trying for both of them. Trash, trash, not not trash, but not buying. Trash, not trash, but not buying. These pretty clean, but I need that leather. Need that leather on them things, bro. That that suede ain't it. Trash. Pure trash. These, nah, these cool, and these fours ain't bad, man. They're not bad at all. Uh, let's hop over here to the everything that's not a Jordan and see what's popping off with that. And we got some React. Sirtus, no, no thank you. Easy pass on that, but if you ever want a comfortable shoe, you don't really rock with Adidas, man. Get you a pair of Reacts. But um, anything React, whether it's React Element, um, uh, React Element or React Presto, React 270, even the Air Max 200s, the Air Max Lite. Nike is really killing the game with um, comfortable, comfortable, wearable shoes that are fashion forward. Like, they're really doing that. Um, them Sacramento's, man, I don't know. I don't know. I would like to see them. I'd consider buying them, but I haven't seen anything really about them yet. Uh, got an all-black React Presto right here. I got a review up on these, not this particular shoe, but a pair of these if you want to check that out. I got a review on some um, React shoes if you want to check those out. Uh, what's this, some camo print, uh, hardwood? Floors or something, don't matter. Passing. Uh, it'll be if I it'll be there if I ever want to go somewhere and backtrack. Got some black forces and some tan forces. Not really interested in that. Um, these ninety fives. That ain't bad, but I wouldn't buy it. <laughs> wouldn't buy it. Y'all know it's that time of season. It's that time of year. For all the uh, all the wheat stuff to be rolling back out, the wheat or the flax. Oh uh, wait, these. Yeah, they're the flax joints. So I was about to say they look leather. Are they not doing them suede this time around? Cause that definitely looks like a leather mid to me. You got some ninety eights over here, looking pretty clean, but no thank you, no thank you on that. Um. You got some Glow 97s. Those ain't bad. I might try to cop those for the low Skiwoski on Sally Welly. You already know how that go. How that go. Oh, we're going backwards now. Uh, these Waffle Racers. That colorway is clean, but nope. Not buying that. This React joint, I can't co-sign that one, bro. <laughs> I can't co sign that one at all. Um, these reggae joints are pretty cool. I like that colorway, but I had to grab that for cheap. This uh heavy metal colorway is alright if you can flex that. These um Halloween joints, I'm gonna have to click on this because that's that's looking that's looking right up my alley right there. Right there. Still in St. Louis, y'all. I ain't got out of St. Louis yet. I don't want to read all that. Get me to the pictures, bro. Mm. Yeah, that's risky there. I like risky. Yeah. I might I might try to cop those, bro. Not day one, though, because I know they're going to be around. But I might try to cop those. Them things, them thing, they're kind of clean. Up top with the bottom. Ah! They could have did something with the sole though. Just a black sole on that. That's kind of weak, but that shoe not bad. Ooh, and my mouse close by. Winning, bro. Now I can. Ooh, look at the, look at the roll. Look at the roll, dog. Dog, look at the roll. Look at the roll, dog. <laughs> we rolling out here. 
just add it just add it what all this drop today oh so them 98s must already be out because i ain't seen them i need to get to the mall bro i definitely need to get to the mall they got another colorway uh was that a ewing or was that a converse oh uh, they got some converses dropping these uh these barrages man i like the the purple colorway of these joints i'm gonna cop that just waiting on the price to drop not really not gonna cop these though but if you're a golden state fan or anybody with this color scheme that'll suit you well do not rush to buy that though you can get that on sale bro don't break your neck go spend the money you ain't got to spend um the shocks is back in full effect not gonna cop none of those shout out to vince carter and making the shocks popular for all you hype beast out there you got some y3s driving there they is. Spend all your money on them. Nobody cares. <laughs> After the Y3s. These are Air Maxes I was talking about earlier when I was driving. Oh, I didn't know that was an undefeated collab. I didn't know that at all. So, yeah, they they not. They going to go. That ain't going to sit at all. Yeah, I didn't know that was um collaboration. They got a black pair just like this, too. And that black pair, that thing go hard. But, uh. Yeah, they got undefeated behind it, so that's going to be another ballpark. You got that white and red. These are the joints I was talking about right here. Them things. Woo! Them things, butter boy. These red ones, they butter too. I'm digging that. But I like the uh, I like that white pair better than that black pair. But I like that black pair better than this white pair. Strange like that. Strange, strange, G. Uh, what is that? Adidas? No, man. You want some Air Moseses? You want the shoes that Moses wore when he split the Red Sea? There they go, right there. Go copy some. Um, these BYWs. Not interested, but I love that shoe. I love that model. It's dope. For all you Nick fans, we back on y'all again. They got some phone posits coming for you. Everything catering to the Knicks. I guess they're expecting something big out of these Knicks that we don't know nothing about for the next basketball season. Or maybe something was in the works big and everything fell through. I don't know what happened. But these Nick shoes, is, these Nick colorways is getting a crazy push. Crazy, crazy push. Adidas keeping it subtle with the Stan Smiths. Is this a collab or anything? Oh, this place is called Fucking Awesome. Anybody know who Fucking Awesome is? I don't know who that is, but just because the shoes say Fucking Awesome on it, <laughs> I consider buying it just because. Like, yeah, the shoes say Fucking Awesome. But these joint right here, boy, these are the joints that I went to, uh, that I went to Dick's to sign up for. These joints right here. Them cloud Yeezys, boy. They going down. I definitely, definitely need that. Y'all see that? And if that's if that's like Carolina blue, Carolina blue, how it's looking, looking right here. Man, get this, get this down. Get that out of there. Like looking how it's looking with that Carolina bluish hue on that thing. Definitely gonna need that. Y'all see that boy? That thing crucial. Ooh, wait. I wonder if they doing if they uh I wonder if they doing reflective and non reflective, cause I don't mind hopping on Yeezy supply to try to get that reflective joint. And just not even worry about these. <laughs> but I don't know if they doing um I don't know if they doing reflective or not, but these things are crucial. Man, look at that. Put that uh that bottom, man. I don't know what if that's the same as the zebras or whatever, but that bottom gonna yellow like crazy, cuz. But I'm copping them. For sure. Two twenty on a tag. Going down, bruh. Going down. I asked earlier, man, if y'all had uh your eyes on anything or anything that y'all was planning to cop or whatnot. 
Let me know in the comments. Trying to see if it's anything else that's dropping right quick. Kaboom. It's the Yeezys, them joints. Huh, Social Status got another collab. Yo, Social Status, man, been getting some um some decent collabs lately, man. Those um, All-Star Sixes, bro, those were dope to me. The Pony Hair Sixes or whatever, I was rocking with those. Just didn't want to pay two fifty for the personal. I'm sure they probably going for cheap, cheap now. I could probably um, grab a pair of those for the Loski Woski. They had those um, Insta Pump Furies. They had a social status joint with the Hornets colorways on it. Those were dope. Um, social status be getting lucky sometimes, man. Sometimes. Uh, they had the raffle at Dicks for these joints today, too. I did not sign up for it, but it's kind of like a, in the pictures, it kind of looked like a, like a sesame to me, like, fit that sesame vibe, but, nah, I ain't about to spend 220 on that. Let me go back over here and get a, uh, get an up-close look on these 12s right quick. To see what that's hitting like. Actually, let me look at these fours first. What they got some mushroom? Oh, these the mids they dropped already. The ones, yeah, I think they already dropped. I didn't know that was like a pack though. But I think um, either Soul Links or J23 hit me off with like 10 million notifications on that shoe that day, and I'm like, bro, don't nobody want that. Don't nobody want that. I guess the pictures ain't low for the fours. They must have only got that one. Be sure to hit that like button if you haven't already. Got to make it a habit to say that over and over. Boom. There they go. Now, this this my issue. Right here. That right there. Why is that not leather or rubber or whatever they make it? That should not look... That should not look ashy like that. That should not be suede, bro. That should not be suede in the first place. Like, why? Why is this suede? Why did they do that? Why did they do that? So, like, this joint up through here is suede, and then this bottom is rubber. You know, your mud guard or whatever. That's rubber there. This is rubber down here on your sole. Then you got... This suede up here, like, man, hey, man, bro. Whoever thought this up, man, we we got some. We got we got to talk. We we got to talk. I need me some insider Nike access or something. But the shoe don't look bad. It's just uh, it's just like that. Like, boom. Now you get the full view. Like, mm, nah. It's not really doing it for me. That front shot looked good, though. That blue going up the tongue. Looked like it's some decent leather on there. Y'all see that little tumble and all? That's that's looking good. Leather quality's looking great. But that suede, bro. That suede or that new buck or whatever that is. It's blowing me right now. Back looks good. That back looking great. Got some uh, extras going on right there, though. But man, bro, that's that's just ridiculous, you know. But it is what it is, I guess, man. They dropping, they coming, people gonna buy. Them. They gonna be all over the place. I say they sit. I say they sit, but that's just my opinion. But at any rate, man, we're going to go ahead and hop off this joint. Man, I appreciate y'all rocking with me. You know, I appreciate y'all uh, bearing with me while I was in the whip on the way back to my destination, to the crib. Um, if you got Dick's, Dick's Sporting Goods in your location and you want them Yeezys, be sure to holler at them because they getting them now some type of way. And it's another avenue for Yeezys, man, so... You can try that. They always get the J's. I actually bought my um, 
first pair of J's that I ever bought from Dix was the um, French Blue Twelves. I bought those in like '03 or '04 on the first release. Cop those joints. Well after release day. Just walked in, walked out. Easy money. In a size 14. Back when big shoes used to be popular. They used to be around. But yeah, bro. That was my brief little story time. Hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> Until next time, man. It's your boy McFly. I'll let you.